another procession today as the remains of Maine State Police Detective Ben Campbell were brought to Southern Maine this a day ahead of his funeral, which is set for Portland tomorrow. He was killed last week while helping a motorist along I-95 in Hamden. News Center Samantha York was part of the caravan from Millinocket today, and she joins us now with from South Portland with more. Sam? Yeah, good evening, Cindy and Rob. Yeah, we arrived here in South Portland at the funeral home around 5 o'clock. As you can see behind me, we have state troopers here. That's because someone will be standing watch over Detective Campbell until his funeral services tomorrow. It's a, uh, a long going um, tradition that will honor the life and legacy of a man who would have been 32 years old today. Now his journey started this morning, as you said, in Millinocket. There was a procession that carried him to Bangor from there at around two o'clock. They took off again, heading to South Portland. Now on the way, there were at least 30 overpasses and despite the weather, every single one of them had first responders standing on them in full uniform, uh, sometimes next to their cruisers on fire trucks just coming out to pay their respects, saluting, removing their hats. It was extremely powerful to see and just shows how strong this family in uniform truly is. At one point, state troopers, DOT members, even just people traveling were pulled off to the side of the road to honor Detective Campbell. You know, so people who didn't even know him coming out to say thank you, pay their respects, in honor the life and sacrifice of Detective Campbell. Now for one firefighter who came out to pay his respects today on an overpass, he says it was a moment he will never forget. It's an absolute uh, honor to be able to be out here today to uh, pay our respects to uh, Detective uh, Campbell and I uh, can't think of any other place I'd want to be more than here right now. I didn't know Detective Campbell personally, but it sounds like he was a really outstanding guy. Um, so I think if we could all just try and live our lives uh, the way he lived his, uh, that'd be the best honor we could give him. And as we mentioned, we did follow this procession from Bangor to South Portland. We had it on our Facebook Live. So if you'd like to see any of those tributes that we're talking about, they're truly incredible. Just head to our Facebook page. You can check those out. Uh, the funeral services for Detective Campbell are set for tomorrow at the Cross Insurance Arena in Portland. Of course, we'll have you covered on air and online starting at 1030. Robin, Cindy, back to you. Thank you, Sam, and we'll be covering those services in a variety of places. We'll be on air, on Facebook Live, and on our YouTube channel, as well as our website and mobile app. Again, our coverage of Detective Campbell's funeral in Portland at the Cross Insurance Arena begins tomorrow morning at 1030.